Today I'm going to demonstrate the Ageless Beauty Kit. It comes with two brushes, the Jewel Vegan, which has the fluffy end and the tapered end, amazing for eyes, the face wand, foundation powders, um, pink flesh concealer, face base foundation, Trio Glow Palette. I'm going to show you how to achieve an overall um, day glam using this one kit. So starting with the Mineral Cream Concealer, just to brighten up those under eyes and correct that darkness, make sure you're just keeping it on that inner corner. So we're not taking it right out, we're just pressing the product on the side, right up the side of the bridge of the nose and just in that very dark inner corner. Now I like to go in before my foundation and correct the under eye first. You can see the difference, that's not concealed and that's concealed. And the reason I'm telling you to keep it in that inner corner is because taking it right out here, one, you can see there's not really any discoloration out here so it doesn't need it. But two, if you're concerned about creasing, which really any product, if you put too much under your eyes, is going to crease. Um, the way to try and combat creasing is minimal product and keeping it on that inner corner just where it's needed. So I'm now going in with face base using the face wand, the flat end, to apply. Um, this brush is so luxurious. It's probably one of the nicest foundation brushes I've ever used. Uh, very, very soft and it's got one end for foundation and one end for creams or powders. Uh, I also love the Buffer Baton, which is the concealer and foundation brush, but Today I'm using this because I'm going to be using the powders um, as well in this set. Just glides onto the skin. This foundation is our best selling product. Uh, it's light, it's luminous as you can see. It's got a lovely warm undertone. All our shades are very flattering and complementary to skin tones. Um, gives incredible coverage. That is just one uh, half of a pump. <clears throat> so you can see this side, the coverage, that's just with one layer. It's so flattering on the skin. It gives your skin a beautiful glow. It's a healthy look to the skin. It's not mask-like, it's not powdery, it's not heavy, and it doesn't feel like anything on your skin. I'm just gonna go into this side now. You can see how easy it glides onto the skin. It's so hydrating and moisturizing. So it's really particularly good if you're on the drier side. If you feel like your skin's lost its glow and it's looking dull, this foundation is gonna bring it back to life. Um, and this is, what I'm using is the Ageless Beauty Kit. It has everything you need to create this look I'm creating today. So that's the coverage. One layer, it's light, luminous, feels like nothing on my skin, but it's given me a really nice, even skin tone with a beautiful glow and hydration. Now I'm going in with the illuminator from the Glow Palette. I'm using the dome end, and I'm just gonna apply that to my cheekbone. And you can see that goldy, pearly powder. Now what this does is it gives an illumination. So it's not necessarily a highlighter, it's more of an illuminator, which I much prefer, particularly if you're on the more mature side. Um, I find that traditional sparkly or shimmery highlighters are gonna exacerbate texture, um, open pores, uh, and that's kind of not what I'm wanting to go for. So I like to go for the Illuminator. It's gonna give lift, it's gonna give glow, and it's gonna give me that lit from within look. So I'm now going in with the Peach Punch. I like to do the lighter shades first when I'm using the same brush, just in order to not compromise the brush with the bronzer. So as you can see, that on its own is so pretty. That is just the Illuminator and the Peach Punch. 
I am going to go in with bronzer, but I'll do that last. This is what's going to give that lovely, healthy glow. Really important to bring back the colour and the natural flush to the skin when we've covered our face with foundation. I see a lot of people um, applying a full, full coverage foundation and not applying any blush or bronzer. And that is really what brings the skin back to life and mimics the natural skin, that natural flush. And it's, it's just so flattering. So uh, if you're not using blush and bronzer, give it a go, start light. Um, I like to wear quite a, a good amount of blush, but you can start off light and just build up until you get used to it. But it really will make a big difference. You'll find a lot of people will compliment your skin when you're using glowy blushes and bronzers. Now I'm going in with the bronzer same end of the brush which is that dome end i like to start on my forehead and i work it up into the hairline so there's no white line um, this is just to mimic where the sun would naturally cut catch the face into that cheek contour under that jawline and down the neck. This is super helpful to make sure we don't have any lines. It just pushes the product down. It's light. The bronzer is a better option than foundation, obviously. It's much less transfer, but it will help blend into your neckline. So going in with the same glow palette on the eyes now, I'm using the Jewel Vegan brush. I'm starting with the Illuminator. Again, I'm starting with the lightest shade first. I'm going under the brow just to give a little bit of a lift. And I'm also going to go over my mobile lid. Uh, and that's gonna give you that lovely glow. Again, it's not shimmery, it's not a highlighter as such. It's more of an illuminating product that's going to give lift and glow to the skin. It's gonna brighten as well. Um, I really love a bright, glowy eye, particularly when you're wanting to go for a natural look. Uh, so nothing too heavy this combination of the glow palette the three shades is so pretty so i'm going in with the peach punch now and i'm going to keep that quite high sort of above my crease i've got quite a deep set eye so i'm not wanting to exacerbate that depth too much and i'm wanting to lift the outer corner so i'm definitely finding as i'm getting older my eyes are starting to fall down so I find that this technique with eyeshadow of just dragging upwards and outwards, so we're lifting and elongating the eye, makes a huge difference. <clears throat> okay, now going in with the Summer Kiss Bronzer, same fluffy end of the brush. I'm starting on that outer corner. I'm going quite low, just above the lash line, dabbing in that bit of first bit of color because I want the depth to be deepest on the outer corner and then I'm blending and working it inwards. So pushing it into that crease over the top of the peach punch, but keeping it slightly lower than I went with the peach punch. And just again, pushing upwards and outwards. And that is giving me a lovely soft sunset looking eye. Very subtle, really soft and pretty. You can um, wear it deeper and then go in with an eyeliner and just give your lash line a little bit more definition if you want this for more of an evening look. But this is just a really soft and fresh and pretty eye that you can wear every day. Um, and it's really easy. It's all about placement and blending, um, but super duper easy anyone can do it just need the right tools which this brush is incredible it's so easy to use and as you can see i've done my whole eye so now i'm going to turn the brush around i'm going to use the tapered end to take this under my eye the brown that that bronzy shade so starting on the outer corner and just dragging it in. Little short strokes, don't try to do one big line, just small strokes, little feathery strokes, 
then you'll get a lovely soft diffused line and marrying it up to that outer corner. Make sure there's no gaps. You don't want any little white bits popping through. You want that lovely soft bronzy shade to just be blended out and meeting up in that corner. And that is it. That is my whole face using the Ageless Beauty Kit. You get two brushes, which is essentially four because they're dual ended. You get the foundation, you get the concealer, and you also get the Trio Glow Palette, which is what I've used to do my face and of course my eyes. Uh, if you wanna take this look from day to night, just add in some eyeliner, maybe whack on some lashes. Um, you could also put a stronger lip with this. I've just got a little bit of lip gloss on. But as you can see, if you're looking for uh, a starting point, if you're wanting to try our products and you're just not quite sure um, where to start, this kit is incredible. It gives you all the key components to get that really lovely signature glow that Runway Room is renowned for. Um, and you can follow this tutorial. It's pretty simple step by step. We've got plenty of tutorials on our website as well. Um, and of course, if you look back through our Instagram page, there's lots and lots of small and long tutorials that you can check out. Um, but that is the Ageless Beauty Kit. It is uh, retailing at $199 for all of those products and brushes. So it's great value. Head to runmyroom.com and check it out.